but uh, uh, that's the thing. So Kabir as a character is very understated. He is not flamboyant. He won't wear a suit. He won't sip on martinis. He won't. But he's still at the same time. He's he's got that Shakespearean angle to him that kind of gives him the, the emotional touch because he's kind of relating real conflict with, let's say, a Macbeth or a Hamlet or whatever. And also at the same time when uh, uh, Kabir is fighting people, it has to be realistic in the sense that uh, it's a book, it's not a movie, so you do kind of describe a gunfight as realistically as possible, but at the same time make it a little more cinematic. So uh, I think Kabir is a good character and I hope that uh, there can be many more books with Kabir, or films with Kabir, let's go. Other than your mentor, do you have any author role models? Um, author role models? Yeah. As in, if I, I know them personally, I mean, uh, we talk about James Bond, so Ian Fleming. I mean, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you read a lot? See, of I read a lot of Ian Fleming, and uh, honestly, I think the movies are better than the books for Bond because he wrote it at a point of time where uh, where not everything was uh, exaggerated so that it suits a cinematic style, which is tending to happen now. Uh, but. I do like Daniel Silva, who is one of my favorite uh, authors of this same uh, genre, and um, Frederick Fawcett. But uh, see, that's, very, that's the thing. That's the thing, right? Uh, it's very easily, it's very easy to fall into that trap. Like it could end up looking like a copy of a Fawcett or a Silva. So I had to consciously make an attempt to keep it as original as possible, so that even if I don't intend it, there are no similarities. So. Uh, so yeah, I think Daniel Silva, Frederick Fawcett, Lee Child is a great author too, Jack Lee Child. I'm talking about the similar genre. Uh, yeah. Sir, uh, when a personality like you, a super successful hero, a celebrity, sits beside the no mice like him, Naya Banda Kumar, what do you think? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Well, uh, well, I... Uh, Obviously, when I met him first, I think it's extremely inspirational that he has written a book in this life. And uh, then it, you go, go back to thinking that it's not really the years that you live, it's, it's the experiences that you have and uh, the intellect and how you apply yourself. So I think for someone like me also, I think it's, it's extremely uh, inspirational to, um, you know, be sitting next to him to kind of... Uh, to read this book, uh, this piece of work, and see the amount of work that's been put in by him, uh, and uh, a kind of worldview that he has. So, uh, yeah, it's extremely insp inspiring. Uh, Imran, you've been watching films and reading about What do you pray for? Well, I've read uh, a couple of books recently that were adapted to films, be it, you know, something like A Twilight or A Gone Girl or, uh, or Hunger Games, but uh, nothing really. When you read a book, it's it's about you know you kind of imagine the space and a lot of lot of stuff gets edited down when it uh, eventually goes up there on screen, and you need a sensible director who does that. Some of the films uh, you know miserably fail in that department because nothing really um, goes ahead and and you know kind of uh, supersedes the book. Um, generally, it's the book that is actually the star, and then you have to have. Um, uh, a crew that kind of gives it its due and sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't happen. Like Gone Girl was a great example of something good that was done with the material. Uh, but still I, I prefer the book, uh, I, I like the book a lot, yes. But still a wonderful film uh, based on that. So even on something like this, uh, you'll, you'll need uh, a team that is extremely sensitive to the material, uh, that understands the space. Uh, you know, it's a book that thrills you, it, it, it keeps you at the edge of the seat. And you need a director uh, that understands that. You need uh, actors that understand that and can give you that intensity on screen. No, what about Black Friday? Did you watch Black Friday and? Have you no, unfortunately, you know, I'm not seeing that. Your film has been launched, and interesting that many people have tweeted that there will be a lot of pressure. So, will be a lot of pressure. When tweet and praise, there will be Tweet nahi karte to pressure hota hai. But like I said, let's let's just keep this at the book today. Uh, just enjoy the trailer. It's 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 come out today on YouTube. So we'll have more press conferences uh, for that film very soon, shortly in, in a week, so we can discuss the film then. Sorry? I mean, everyone launches films on YouTube these days, so uh, and also on television. So you'll have the film on television.
Someone's missing, so probably I can start off. She's here. The one that's missing is the one that's supposed to be. Oh, there. all right, all right. <laughs> journalist because 